It's been a while now, Internet! It's been a whole year since I did this last Let's Play. And man, how the time flies. Actually, that seems like a very long time ago when I did Oracle of Seasons. Well, it came a lot later than I expected, but I'm proud to announce I'm finally doing Oracle of Ages with the Cursed Rain. It's funny, because at the end of my uh, initial Oracle of Seasons Let's Play, I think I promised, like, hey, it'll probably be like, one of my next Let's Plays. Whoops. But not whoops. I'm glad I got to spend some time playing some other great games. All right. Yeah, here we go. Found my secret to Labrina. <laughs> and I promise you that this Let's Play will have better audio quality than Oracle of Seasons Cursed. At least it gets better in Episode 5. And also you'll notice there's a blue orb around Link this time. Other than that, the openings are very similar. Oh yeah, it's sunset now, and it used to be dawn, but now it's sunset because it's cooler, apparently. It's The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Ages, it's an underrated Zelda game, it's time to start the Let's Play. Alright, I have to get weird again, alright. <laughs> As you can see, we need to start a new file, and... Naturally, I have to go to Secrets to make sure I start with the Cursed Rain. I'm actually going to be doing this Let's Play as a continuation or a linked playthrough from my initial Oracle of Seasons one. So, to start, I'm going to enter the code I got at the very end of my Oracle of Seasons Let's Play. And this will let me start Oracle of Ages with a bunch of stuff carried over from Oracle of Seasons, like my reins, as well as my name, the name of the little kid. Just a lot of stuff gets carried over. Alright. Also, for those of you who did not see my Oracle of Seasons uh, Let's Play, which I don't blame you if you didn't, or if you just want a refresher, basically what I mean by when I say I'm doing a Cursed Let's Play, I'm going for the whole game wearing the Cursed Rain, which halves your sword damage as well as doubling the damage you take from enemies, and I'm not allowing myself to get any new heart containers. I will start with four heart containers, because you have to start with four heart containers if you're carrying over your reins from a previous Let's Play, and I need to start the Cursed Rain, so here we go. This should be the secret. Haha, <laughs> yeah! Ooh, my Game Over screen is even at zero. I'm not sure if that... Yeah, but you, the Game Overs carry over. No, they don't. I had a ton of Game Overs for my last Let's Play, and you'll notice I'm playing the harp. Yep. That uh, signifies that you're playing a Link playthrough. All right, enough talking. Let's start the game. Uh, fast. Yeah, let's do fast. And we get this bonus scene at the beginning. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Onyx, General of Darkness, Twin Rova will not let your death go to waste. Behold, Onyx, the troublesome, the troubles you cause now burn in the flame of destruction. When the flames of sorrow and despair burst into flame, we will offer up the sacrifice, and the dark rites of the Gerudo will be complete! Then the evil king shall return. You only get that if you're playing a Link playthrough, and otherwise it would start here. This looks so familiar. Accept our quest, hero! Oh, deja vu. And unlike Oracle of Seasons, we don't collapse at the beginning of this one. Oh, it's been a while. I've been meaning to do this for a while, and I'm so happy I'm finally doing this Let's Play. HELP! Who's that? Oh, it's Fat Impa. Never fear, Fat Impa. Link is here. That was frightening. I was suddenly attacked. Thank you, Traveler. What is your name? Artie, is it? I see a Triforce symbol on the back of your left hand. That is the sign of a Hyrulean hero. That must be why the beasts fled. I am Impa, nurse to Hyrule's Princess Zelda. Zelda asked me to find a singer named Nehru. Will you help me look, Artie? I'd feel safer with you nearby. Why are you blue? Seriously, she's got a blue tint to her. Well, yeah, we got Impa following us around now, and... Oh, we can't open it. If you do a Link playthrough, you actually start with a sword, but we can't equip it right now, apparently. You also know the overworld looks a bit different from Oracle of Seasons, just everything has slightly different graphics. What a great spot! Such clean air! Now if only time could stop. 
This is the animal's utopia! Soon more animals come! Alright, thank you, monkeys. Oh, that's it! Whoa, she can warp! This rocket with the triangle as a sign! Could you move this rock for me, Artie? I'll, um, I'll just... I can't do it. Really. Nehru's house up, Lina City down. Let's go to Lina City. Where are you going? Hurry up and move this! Uh, yeah, you're right. Fine, Impa. You can push the other way as well. Thank you. Now let's go. More like let's play, am I right? Ooh, music. Ooh, different music. Oh, it's a house made into a tree. Interesting. It's Nehru and a bunch of animals. Hey, Macaw. No, I have to hear Nehru's song. La la li la 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 li la la. Huh? Nehru's the best singer in Labrina! How oh, charming. Shh, I can't hear Nehru sing! Man, everyone here is a jerk. Sit here and listen. How charming. Almost as much as honey. Hey, I wanna hear- I gotta wanna get a closer listen. Isn't it enchanting? Oh yeah, we get this cool little, um... Cool little scene. This is the best the Game Boy Color could do, guys. Sorry. You're Hyrule's messengers, aren't you? Impa and Artie, right? A bird brought message of your arrival. My name is Ralph. I am an old friend of Nehru's. We're counting on you. Thank you. You've come all the way from Hyrule, correct? Pleased to meet you. I'm Nehru. I've been very worried after hearing that Labrina would face many evil troubles. Don't worry, Nehru, I'm here. I'll chase away any beast that comes near you. Sorry, Artie, but I doubt we'll need you. I'm sorry, Artie. Ralph is always like this when it comes to me, but I feel that something evil is approaching, just as Ralph claims. Ralph didn't claim that. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> You are correct. Not bad for a diva. Not bad for Nehru, Oracle of Ages. Something terrible will happen right now before your very eyes. Well, but first let me hide behind a wall. It's a black flame with eyeballs. The most terrifying creature in Hyrule. Actually, this isn't in Hyrule. Thank you, Artie. You allowed me to pass through the sacred barrier. I've been waiting for this moment. I'm Varan, Sorceress of Shadows. Hi, Varan. You're cooler than Onyx. You've got more of a personality. Nehru, Oracle of Ages, I shall make your body my own. <laughs> yeah, no joke. This is seriously happening. And now Nehru, she was blue to begin with. Let's make her even more blue. Ooh, he's got a sword. What are you doing to Nehru? I'll cut you in two if you don't let her go. Ha! Aren't you brave turning a sword at me? If you cut me, it's Nehru who dies. Nehru is no mere diva. She's the Oracle of Ages who controls time. Now the Oracle's powers are mine. I can travel through time as I choose. And make lightning strike anytime I want. Just like Onyx. Now a new age shall begin. The Age of Darkness. <laughs> and yet she still has more personality than Onyx. I shall go to the past and do as I please. Here's something I've always wondered how that like this happens. Haha! <laughs> By going into the past, I can make this guy old! Somehow! Not sure how that works. It does make sense how you can make things just vanish.
This, however, does not make sense. <laughs> How can you turn someone just to stone? But just by going into the past. That Varan! She couldn't touch the, st the stone, so she used you to get in here! I've known Nehru since the was the Oracle of Ages since she was a child. I've always been beside her, protecting her. But now this, Nehru! Nehru, wait, I'll save you. Nehru! All right, that's enough shouting her name. Okay, that's getting old. Oh, Artie, you saved me! To think I was possessed! <coughs> I'm sorry. I failed Zelda. Zelda. She sensed an evil shadow drawing near Nehru and asked me to bring her to Hyrule. We should not have forgotten you, the hero of Holodrum. Look what has happened now. That Varan lady is frightening. I was forced to do her will, in spite of myself. Varan said she'd go back in time. She must ho uh, hope to use Nehru's powers to launch some plan in the past. Labrina already feels the effects. Already, first holodrum, now Labrina faces its doom. I'm sorry to ask so much, but we can rely on no other. Please, save Nehru. Ah, yes, Zelda entrusted this shield to me. Please use it. Ah, oh, we got a wooden shield! Fun fact, if you don't do a linked playthrough, she'll give you the wooden sword then. You have to actually buy the wooden shield. Artie, can you go meet the Meiku tree in Lina Village? The Meiku tree's the guardian of the Labrina. Surely she can help. Nehru's house is in the woods east of here. I'll be there. And we get the song, and we get the song, we get the song, the overworld song, and we can equip the sword. Sweet! However, very first thing I've got to do. Let's go to the city and get my rings. This is Luna City. Thank you, dude. So, that's the shop. We can go up to the Mako Tree. But, ah oh yes, the ring shop. Good to see you. Welcome to Vasu Jewelers. Oh, you don't have a ring box? I like you, so here, take this ring box. You got a level one ring box. It can hold one ring. Sweet. I'm Red Snake. I am keeper of the rain secrets. Make a choice. I'm gonna say my secret. <coughs> Excuse me. So I think I took a picture of the red snake. Come on. Ah oh, yes, I believe I believe this is it. If not, then shoot, I'm gonna have to load up Oracle of Seasons and learn that secret. Walla Walla Washington, oh Walla Walla Washington, oh Walla Walla Washington, it's gray, cause it's Washington. Walla Walla Washington, oh Walla Walla Washington, oh now we do the minus sign, followed by the left parenthesis, and the lead, the number six, I'm sorry. Hmm, okay, I've brought your rings from Holodrum, so see Vasu to check your list. Sweet. Do come in. I'm Luigi. Give me my list. All right. There's the cursed rain. Rains do nothing unless worn. So let's equip it. <laughs> the game just became like four times harder. The Meku tree stands at the far end of this cave. Meku path. By the way, for those of you who are wondering. Uh, first off, Holodrum is the place where I was in Oracle of Seasons, so when they say like, Oh yeah, you're the hero of Holodrum, that means you, um, we saved Holodrum in the past. <coughs> also, this is not here if you're not doing a Link playthrough. It's the Hero's Cave. Hard- easily one of the hardest Zelda dungeons ever. We'll come back here later. Much later. This is where we want- actually, we're gonna explore around a bit first. Guess who moved here from our last Let's Play? Artie, it's been too long! It has! I've moved to this city, too. It's nice to see a familiar face. Artie, we meet again. Do you remember naming our son Rome? He's quite well. Where have you been, Artie? Do you remember me? Of course, it's Rome! Mom and Dad are doing well, too. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. 
Yep! I named the kid Rome after Rome Mithril. He's one of my favorite Let's Players. He got me into Mega Man. Oh yeah, we need some rupees. Hey dude! Ho ho! I am Troy! In my younger days, I traveled the world and saw many animals. Even at my age, I'm quite dedicated. You shall promise if you come to hear me speak. Just between us, I've seen a monster called a Wisp that jinxes you when you touch it. You can't take your sword out when it happens. How frightful! Are you just gonna tell me about the enemies in the game? Forget that. House of the Know-It-All Birds! First-timers, welcome! I'm far from a first-timer. Ominous music, huh? This must be a dungeon! As a matter of fact, I am heading to the final dungeon right now. But we can't enter it. No joke, this is actually the final dungeon. Alright. We can't go out this way, because- Oh no, it's a rock! And Link is so weak, he can't move it or pick it up himself. Granted, the rock is the size of Link, but... Still, I mean, that's pretty weak. I did not mean to cut your dog, I'm so sorry. I am Mamu Yan. Mamamu Yan, I'm sorry, the top breeder in town. My dog is much cuter than that dog. Much cuter. But my dog is very shy. Do you know of a good way to hide its face? Um, no, I don't. So yeah, in a linked playthrough, you'll face different challenges. Some things are easier, some things are harder. I'm probably gonna forego all of the things that make it easier and just do the harder stuff. That joke goes against our aesthetics, you know. So what kind of candy's never on time? Choco mate! Isn't that a sweet joke? Oh, 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 oh bravo, sir. Bravo. I love that. So what kind of- Oh. That's all you say, dude? Come on. What's going on? My grandson is turned to stone. How? Why? Wake up. Call me grandma again. Okay, that's sad. I don't- Artie doesn't like to d dwindle on depressing things on his channel. I want to uplift people. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Ouch! You can't carry them like that. Uh, okay. Man, there are rocks everywhere. It's almost like they're deliberately trying to keep you out of certain areas until you've done certain things. Meku Tree? Lately, folk have been vanishing and turning to stone without warning. What's happening? I am Plen, the mayor here in Lena City. Lena is a long history, reaching back hundreds of years. Back then, it was Lena Village, not a city. Even though it was exactly the same size. And hey, treasure chest there, but we can't reach it for a very long time. Not until we beat the seventh dungeon, I believe. Anyways, enough dawdling. We're going in here. Make a road. Kind of like the Heroes Cave from Oracle of Seasons, this is like the pre-dungeon. It's even easier, though. Danger! Danger! Very catchy music, though. Danger! Seriously, they've boarded up like half the rooms. Whatever. Pleased to meet you, young hero. I'm the Meku Tree, guardian of Librina. Yeah, it's a female tree this time. Faran, Sorceress of Shadows, has taken Nehru, the Oracle of Ages. She's disrupting the flow of time from the past. She's trying to flood this world with the power of sorrow. We cannot give in to one of impure heart. You must stop Varan and soon. But to stop her, you'll need some... thing. Whoa. Rainbow tree. Ah. I feel so weird. I'm vanishing. Something must be happening to me in the past. Help! Well, that's disconcerting. The Meku Tree? This is more of Varan's work! Hardy, you made it! Varan just leapt through this time portal! If we go back in time, we should be able to save Nehru and the Meku Tree! I'm coming, Nehru! And here's the main gimmick of Oracle of Ages! It's the same as Ocarina of Time's gimmick, traveling forward and backward in time. 
Another one? First that guy with the weird hat appears, then you? Ever since that girl Nehru came, there's been all sorts of weird goings on. <coughs> Tell me more. We're in a village down there, so we are now in the past. We are several hundred years in the past, unlike Ocarina of Time. So, stuff has actually changed quite significantly. Ugh! Why is that clown watching the father and son play with their ball? It, it's like you're know, trying to have a touching father-son moment, and Ronald McDonald is just, like, creeping on them in the background. Like, that's not cool, man! They look like a happy family! I wish I could join them! Dude, go back to McDonald's and stop bugging them. Okay, faster this time. I'll throw it, so catch it, Dad! The village is at hard with the construction of Queen Ambie's tower, but you still gotta spend time with the kids! Hey, nice one! Alright, let's try collecting some swag. And by that I mean rupees. I need to buy some stuff! I like how all the exploration in this. There's tons to explore, even at the very beginning of the game. Shevel's house. Shevel, you need to fix your bridge. Or learn to jump, I guess. More ember seeds, but we can't carry them just yet. The queen was very kind until only recently. You can ask the village elder about the queen. He lives across the river, near the tower. The village is full of excess dirt from the tower. There's no room to walk, and any tools we could use to clear a path are being used for construction. Well, that just stinks. Oh, hey, hey, hey. It's the GBA nature. Uh, adv I'm sorry, the GBA Time Shop. This is only open if you are playing this on a Game Boy Advance or a Game Boy Player. So, if you bought the virtual console release, tough luck. This is Lena Village. Hwa! Oh, excuse me, we haven't had any nights for a few days now. Oh, he was yawning. Whoops. Make a path is blocked off by some dirt, and Link is too weak to break it. The village has been full of rubble ever since work started on that tower. You can't get anywhere without a shovel to clear a path. Well, call me Shovel Knight because I'm going to get a digging implement. I've got puns and spades. <laughs> this isn't good! I want to deliver the mail on time, but I can't do it if I don't know the time! Yeah! I'm currently on the job! Queen Ambie had a boyfriend, a seafaring man, but he set sail one day and never came back. She's building a, fall t a tall tower so she can search the lands for any sign of his return. It's called Ambie's Tower. It was a touching tale. Was. Ambie's Palace and Ambie's Tower. Hey, Ambie! I'm home! Hey, dude, let me in. I know the Queen. Queen Ambie's busy! She's in no mood for any of you. Come empty-handed? Bring her a rare item in tribute if you wish to see her. I've got this great thing called the Cursed Rain. Actually, I've got a great thing called the Red Rain. I'm not gonna be using that. Let me just go to the present. Oh, wait, I can't go to the present. Darn gasha seeds sprouting, growing, making nuts, and all those new nuts got different stuff inside. Ha! Get rid of it for me. Ah, we get the gasha seed! Yay! I know there's soil right by my house, but don't go planting seeds there. I will plant seeds wherever nature calls me to. Ooh, here's good. So, once again, if you didn't see my Oracle of Seeds, let's play. These are gasha seeds. You plant them in soil, wait, uh, kill a bunch of enemies, come back, and it'll be fully grown with a nut inside. You can have various prizes inside. P paper! Do you have any paper? Nope. Oof, it's heavy. Oh, that's no fun. Hey, dude, why build such a huge fiend? It's just work, work, work! This is the entry to the tower being built to the heavens by the order of Queen Amby. At first, this tower was being built to guide Queen Ambie's love safely back from the sea. But ever since Nehru came, the sun sits high in the sky as if time itself has stopped. It's not like Queen Ambie to push us so hard. In the village, they started calling it the Black Tower. That's the final dungeon. You can look around, but the construction of some area is closed. If you hang around too much, though, you might get yelled at. 
Well, that's not good. Black Tower! Black Tower! Alright, we gotta find a shovel and leave. And I don't really want to talk to all these guys who are just like, Oh, I'm William worked so hard. We dig, 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 dig in a mine the whole day through. That's a lot we like to do. We're supposed to finish tomorrow, but we're way behind schedule. We'll never make it. I'll give me a shovel and I'll help for two seconds. We must finish the tower for Ambi as quickly as possible. Huh? A digging tool? That's the spirit, Sonny! Here, you can have this shovel. Can you use the shovel to move that dirt out of the way? You know why I can. Start digging. We're working hard on this tower. Help us out. I'd love to. They don't call me Artie the Digger for nothing. Actually, they don't call me Artie the Digger. Please don't start. Hey, dude. There's no going past this point. Nothing up there is complete, so there's no entry. Now get. Bent, bent, bent. Got your conk. Let me help you with that. Dude, you're mining nothing now. Oh, I can Okay, these guys are spending hours like, oh, this one little piece of dirt. It's so hard to mine, and I'm just like, huh, wuss. Alright, we gotta save the maple tree. Oh, but. F oh, wait, no, 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 no. Not getting pieces of heart. Nope. But you can just dig the pile of dirt out of the way if you want to get the piece of heart. Oh, no. Nope. I'll explore more tough town later, but I want to finish this episode and I don't want to do that before uh, saving the Maku tree. So here we go. And it's Maku Road again. This time it's bigger and has lame music. What the heck? And, um, puzzles. Yeah. Like, push a block! Alright. Here we're actually facing enemies now. Enemies now! And I take a lot of damage from enemies, so I better be careful. Hey, little bots! Take that, and that, and that! I'm the maze. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Do do. Oh, what do you mean I can't dig this? It looks like sand. Now here's where things get tough. You actually have to push the blocks in the right order. Also, some treasure chests in this look different. I don't know why. But you'll know in Oracle of Seasons, none of the chests look like this. We get a small key. Use it to open a locked door or a block in this dungeon. There are key blocks. Oh yes, there are. You need to use the key to unlock the block. But for the most part, they're just key doors. Ooh, now things get really tough, because here, we actually have to push these blocks in a weird order just to step on the button. Hi, it's Stalfoses! It's been ages since we've seen you guys. And if you push the block down... I'm sorry. If we push the block up and then to the... Uh, left, we can get that piece of heart. But we don't want a piece of heart. We want to make life difficult for ourselves. Up the stairs. Wee, this is the guy Varan was talking about. Get him! No! No! Leave me alone! Hey, dude. What's with you? Keep clear! Ah! Oh, oh, dear! Get them! Like that. Man, they stuck. They stunk. Wow, you were so daring and cool. <coughs> Th thank you. Who are you? Artie, what a nice name. I'm the Meku Tree. You were brave. They said the Oracle of Ages convinced Queen Ambi to build a black tower. Maybe she made them attack me. Thank you for rescuing me. I'll never ever forget it. And I promise I'll repay you when I grow up. This is about all I can do. Aha! She opened the door. Remember, I'll repay you when I grow up. Be sure to come see me. I will. Dear, um, uh, when I grow up, I'm gonna be your bride. Ah, I said it! And yeah, things got weird. Anyways, no, I'm not ending the episode off here. We're talking to the adult Maku Tree. 
And because she opened the gate in the past, the gate's open in the present. It's been open for hundreds of years. Uh, it's weird. It all seems so foggy. I'm forgetting so much. Oh, you, you're already, already. Why? Stop it. No, this is so weird. Why are you here now? I've been waiting so long for you. Don't you remember hundreds of years ago? Artie, you promised. I did not. When I grow up, I'll marry you. That's what you said, Artie. I did know nothing of the sort. I did not. I did not say that. I did not. 400 years I waited. Oh, 400 year time gap. But I knew you wouldn't forget about me. Our hearts are bound across time by a fret of... What? That's not why you're here? Why won't you listen to me? Fine, you want to talk about Varan, right? Maybe Varan is using Queen Ambi to raise the power to being to the heavens. If one of impure heart gains the powers of shadow, this world will be covered in darkness. That's what this is about. Is that from Ansem? To know the past is to know the present. Varan can do as she pleases if she finds dark power in the past. All will go dark. Artie, you must stop Varan and save Nehru. Must I say it again? No. I don't recall, but I think you need the eight essences of time hidden in the Labrina to beat Varan. The essences hold the power to see the truth, and they hold my memory. You won't beat Varan if you can't see the truth. That sounds like an excuse. With the flow of time disrupted, my memory's fading. What will we do? I'm at a loss. But if you find the essences, I'll remember everything, and you'll be able to stop Varan. Please do this, Artie. First, I want you to go to Yall Graveyard in the east. I heard the first essence there. I can't do much, but take this. The ember seeds in this seed satchel will offer light in dark places and burn small trees from your path. We got a seed satchel, and it has 20 ember seeds inside it. And that's where we're going to end the episode off. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Color Forty. I'm so glad to be Let's Playing in 2017. At last, tune in for the next episode. Please do. And I hope you guys watch this one, even if you didn't watch Oracle of Seasons Cursed. Have a great day, and God bless.